question question on from the SH SAT um, test and this again is just a good logical reasoning question to practice here we have every member of club X is also a member of club Y so I'm going to write that over here if you're in club X then you have to be in club Y as well we don't we're not told notice that if you're in club Y you're guaranteed to be in X that's not true the reverse is true so if you walk in club X you're a member you automatically become a member of club Y but that doesn't mean that everyone that's in club Y came from club X they could have come from somewhere else so we'll be careful with that one that's our first bit of information some members of club Z are also members of club Y so we have all the people in club Y here's the people in club Z what do we know? we know that some members, maybe this many are also members of club Y we don't know how that matches but we know there's some relationship there between these two clubs so maybe out of all the people in club Y there's a smaller group that are also a, a small group in club Z there's a connection there but we want to know based on that information alone which of the following must be true so we say in A if Sonia is in club X she is not in club Z well Sonia is a member of exactly two clubs so she can't be a member of three so if she walks into club X we know that she has to be a member of club Y and that's her two clubs so she cannot also be a part of Z and that's the correct answer but let's look at the other ones just to, to clarify why they don't make sense if Sonia is in club Y she is not in club Z well like we said some people in club Y are also in club Z to get in this club club Y you don't have to come from X but we know that everybody who's in X right is also in Y but it doesn't make up everyone in the club right there are other people in that in that group so B is out if Sonia is in club Y she must be in club X again if you picture it like this everyone from club X is going into club Y perhaps this club Y is really big so there are other people hanging out in that club who are not from X so this is not true all members of club Y are in at least two clubs that's not guaranteed right look at this picture right here here are all the people in the club this group can be in Z this group can come from X so those are on two clubs but there could be some other people hanging out in club Y that are not from X or Z and only stay in club Y so D is out as well all members of club Z are in at least two clubs well we know that there are there's a group from Y and Z that are in two clubs but we don't know if that's everybody in group Z so that one's out as well and A is the only one that has to be true alright hope that helped